Hello, Ms. My Mama here. My name is Nina, and today I'm doing the Women Who Collab Thursday video, Friends Chooses My Makeup. I was paired up with Chelsea this week, and she shows my Avatar palette. So, it's a really gorgeous palette. And she shows Panopyra, Coral Queen, Iliu. Tide Pool and Spirit Tree. And so I did swatch them out because I wasn't sure on the shimmers. Which one to use where? And this top is a shimmer, but it's not very shimmery. I mean, it is shimmery, but not as much as some of the others. So I'm going to use that. Kind of like a matte, I think. But let's jump into this look and get started. Um, real quick, I thought I would mention. Um, for my base, I've been trying out this Laura Geller. Um, it says it's a blush stick, but it's a contour stick. I've been using this for like a week and a half now. And it blends in so nice. I got it in shade Espresso Martini. Um, I got this from the Amazon Vine thing that I do. And it is stunning. Like, I just love the way it blends in. It's so creamy. It goes on easy. I also have one of the actual blush sticks in Doro Berry. Right here. And it blends amazingly well as well. I got it from Vine as well. Absolutely stunning. Could not believe how well it worked. And then, um, for my blush and my highlighter, I've been using these two best. This is a new one that they came out with. It's Pink Bubble. And amazing. I absolutely love the blush and the contour ones in these. And I've tried, there's some other brands. I know they're Charlotte Tilbury, but I'm not paying that much for a blush. So... Lake Rain came out with some. Hello Kiss has come out with some. Cubest has come out with a lot. I thought there was another one. That's Hello Kiss. Zaza Viti. <coughs> Let's come up with some. And they're all really nice. Um, I've used them all quite a bit. The only part of them I'm not sure about is the highlighter. I used one of the highlighters today, and it's a little sticky, but it blended in really nice. It's a little sticky, though, on my cheek. I can feel it when I touch it. I just thought I would mention those real quick, because I've been, like, super impressed by them, and the Charlotte Tilbury type dupes are amazing. No, I can't compare them to Charlotte Tilbury, because I don't have any of those, and I don't plan on getting any of those, so... Yeah. <laughs> so I'm going to go into Coral Queen first. This is really pretty. Pinkish purple. I already got eye primer on. It's just my one from She Glam. I did not need to go quite that high, but... Oh, well. So I got this palette because of the Avatar series. Does anybody else into like the Avatar stuff? I love like anything kind of mystical. But I love watching the Avatar movie, the first one, and I still need to see the second one. I don't go to movie theaters. That's why I haven't seen it yet. 
my anxiety does not like confined spaces for strangers at all. Right now I'm just trying to make sure I blend that out good. Alright, now I'm going to go into Tide Pool, it's that dark purple shimmer right here. I'm not sure how this picks up on a brush. Hmm, it picks up. Let's see how it does on the brush. It works pretty good. Let's see what. Some darkness part in here. So has anybody seen the second avatar? Like I don't want no spoilers, just this was it good. Is it worth going to worth trying to see? Let's see what color that is left. Mm -hmm. Alright, so I'm gonna take Ilio. Put that on the first part of my eye. It's like a really pretty like purple, like fuchsia purple with a blue shimmer in it. It's really pretty. And then I'm taking Spirit Tree, the darker purple. It's like a black base. Shimmer. Back into Ilyu because I went over too far with that. I'm just trying to blend them together a little bit. Okay, and then Panopyra. I don't know how to say that word exactly. It's going to go in my inner corner. It's really light. I like that. I like blurring up my inner corner shirt a little bit. And then out. I don't know if anybody else does it that way. That's just how I like doing it. I'm taking Coral Queen again underneath the eyelid. And then back into Tide Pool as well. So I'm softening the edge a little bit with my finger. There we go. Alright, I'm going to do the other eye. Put on mascara and I'll be right back. Just with my finished look, I put on this cool eyeliner by Bethelan. It's a multi-chrome. I put it on my waterline. I don't know if you can see any of the shift in here. But it's like a purple liner and then it's just green. It's really pretty. And then I put on some half lashes I got from Timu. I put on my Fenty, I forget what the shade's called. Scala Sister. I love the texture of the Fenty lipsticks, they're amazing. Oh, and I used my Lip Job liner from Dragon Beauty. So that's the eye look I created today. It goes really well with, I don't know if you can even tell, but I added, I redid like the color of my hair. Or I just like added, did the unicorn hair. It was the pink one, I don't know what it's called. 
So it pretty much just goes over my grave. But it looks really good with this eye work. So, I know my hair looks a mess, but, um, so I took, I did my hair last night, I dyed it, and took a shower, and when, when I woke up this morning, because I don't put, I don't keep my hair up anymore when I sleep, because it's not good for it, when I woke up this morning, it actually looks like it used to, I mean, I can still feel that it's thinner than it used to be, but it's, it's progress in the right direction, so today I was like, I don't care if it looks like a hot mess, it looks like my hair again. So, that's my look for today. Make sure you go check out everybody else's looks. Go see what colors I picked for Chelsea. She did an amazing look like always. Um, let me know what you think down below. Thank you so much for spending part of your day with me. And I hope you all have a wonderful day. Bye.